There is growing interest in DNA vaccines. First, they offer a safer and more cost-effective alternative to conventional vaccines, which are sometimes constructed using weakened microbes. Second, DNA vaccines, now readily synthesized in the laboratory, are also promising for taming cancer growth. Once these artificial DNA constructs are administered in vivo, the body translates the new genetic information into a protein, the actual vaccine. In their recent publication in Advanced Functional Materials, Frank Fan Ching Chen from Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory, Yu Hong Xu from Shanghai Zhao Tong University, Hadi Shafi'i from Harvard Medical School, and their co workers successfully applied oscillating gold nanoparticles to efficiently immunize mice against the hepatitis C virus core gene. The idea of stimulating the immune system using DNA vaccination is promising and a powerful concept. The problem is that introducing these DNA molecules into the cells uh, through their strong protective cell membrane has been a great challenge. So we have now overcome this barrier through our proprietary nanotechnology by introducing electrically activated gold nanoparticles that actually oscillate rapidly and create very tiny holes on the cell membrane in order to allow these DNA molecules to trespass the cell membrane. Unlike other approaches, the nanoparticles are not tethered to their biological cargo, a refinement that can boost therapeutic potency and effectiveness. The oscillatory motion of the particles under an electric field and their interaction with cells was investigated by a dark field microscopy system using a specifically designed electrophoretic chip the particle diameter and the applied voltage affected the migration rate. Transmission and scanning electron microscopy confirmed that 50 and 100 nanometer particles caused an approximately two to three-fold increase in cell poration and the formation of larger pores, respectively. The efficacy of the particles in administering the DNA vaccine in vivo was investigated in a mouse model. After injection of the mixture into the tibia muscle, Gentle electrical stimulation caused particle uptake into muscle cells. Within just two weeks, treated mice developed a very strong immune response against a model HCV vaccine. Antibody response was boosted up to sevenfold compared to the control after 70 days. Like the antibody level, the level of interferon gamma secreting T cells increased with particle diameter and with negative surface charge. Future refinement of this method will enable targeted delivery of precisely defined doses of molecules extending beyond DNA by including RNA, peptides, and small molecules. To find out more, please visit the Advanced Functional Materials homepage.